In keeping with its commitment of ensuring adequate and equal access to water by all citizens of Guyana, the Guyana Water Incorporated undertook the drilling of three new wells at Diamond, Sparandam and Sapphire in Region 4. This undertaking saw the company partnering with Dutch well drilling firm Deruta Groundwater Technique to utilize the reverse circulation drilling technique which has never before been used in Guyana. The new technique is very beneficial as compared to the straight flush drilling technique which was previously used by GWI. The Dutch is utilizing uh, a new drilling technique called uh, the reverse circulatory drilling. And what, what this process is, is they form a platform to create an, a, an overpressure to maintain the borehole. And so they send the drilling fluid along with air, creating pressure down the sides of the, of the borehole and bringing the cuttings from the bit up through the center, coming through the drilling pipes. And so this produces not only a, a, a large borehole, but it utilizes less or no bentonite at all to maintain the, the aquifer formations without any caking or anything like that. And this, of course, produces, helps us to, in aid of um, producing a greater capacity well and also the, having us to reduce on the level, the time used to, for development, the development process. The new wells were drilled at a total cost of some 121 million Guyana dollars and have no doubt positioned GWI to improve its level of service for residents within those communities. Ten weeks of drilling of the new well at Diamond, East Bank Demerara, at a depth of 201 meters, resulted in that well successfully producing 200 meter cubes of water per hour. The water pressure in that area has also improved. Yeah. Right now it's um we're producing a 2.2 meter cube, 27 psi. Uh, the well will benefit approximately 3,000 customers, which would we would see an increase in their level of service. There are still some troubleshooting with our network, whereby um, you've seen for the front part of Diamond they increase from 5 psi to 9 psi, and at the back from 1.5 psi to 3.5 psi, and that that's a, that's a significant improvement for the start, but um, we're still working, our distribution team is still working. Over on the east coast of Damarara, customers were gifted with increased water supply for Christmas as a new well drill at Sparandam produced water following seven weeks of preparatory work and four weeks of drilling. That well serves approximately 2,000 customers. And the level of service because of the growing demand in the communities was a bit low and so we decided to utilize this new drilling technique in the Sparndam area, the Sparndam well compound. And so we have drilled a new well to the depth of 233 meters now. And so the production in there has almost been doubled. The third and final well drilled by the Dutch company is located in Sophia. This plant is under tremendous pressure to produce to meet the demand in the community. And so we decided to drill a similar well to the one in, in Sparandam and, and Diamond. And so this, this plant produces approximately 12 megaliters per day, megaliters of water. And this, well, this new well now will increase that production by another four megaliters. And so the, the new production may be around 16 megaliters of water. The exchange of technical information was also done by the Dutch Drilling Company as its managing director, Mr. Franz Heinz, delivered a presentation to GWI engineers and other technical personnel on the reverse circulation drilling technique. Even as GWI continues to move aggressively to ensure water sustainability across the country, this new technique will now influence its procedure for well drilling in Guyana.